Let's go. What's up, money geeks? Mr. V here. Welcome to another video, guys. So in this video, we are going to take a look at top five stocks with short interest over 20%. So again, if you guys have been watching this the last two weeks, uh, I think we've getting these meme stocks are starting to bounce back. And uh, again, Reddit is doing what Reddit does, push um, stocks that are highly shorted um, just to kind of you know, stick it to Wall Street. So we're going to cover those top five in this video. But before we get started, guys, if you're new to the channel, we talk about how to earn money, how to save money, how to invest and build wealth. So that's something that interests you. Go ahead and hit that subscribe button and the notification bell so you don't miss out on new content. So, guys, again, uh, these are meme stocks. So you see some of the names are names that we know. Uh, and the reason why they're calling them meme stocks is because uh, a lot of them are squeezing not based on their fundamentals, but just based on people pushing it. So it's like uh, retail traders going against Wall Street. So if Wall Street says this company is bad based on fundamentals well, that they want to short it. Uh, and then retail traders is like, nope, we got this. So we're going to go in there and squeeze uh, the, the stock up. So that's why uh, when you hear meme stocks, that's what's going on. So again, let's jump right here. The first one here on this list, again, and this list is actually organized so that um, on, you have to have at least short interest of over 20% to make it to this list. So if you can see here in this column right here, oh, I can, yeah, so the short interest column, it has to be over. 20%. So if there's anyone that's below 20%, it's not going to show up here. So let's jump in. First one here you can see is Workhorse. So let's take a look at Workhorse here and see uh, what's going on there. So Workhorse has actually been squeezing up uh, lately. Again, not because of fundamentals, but just simply because of people looking at it, the stock being overshorted. So we can see just the, the last five days, um, the stock is up 66%, which is insane. So let's go uh, the last month. 96% for just the last month, which is insane. So this definitely fall in that category. So that again, Workhorse appears to be number one on that list. So if we switch back again, number two here is uh, Clover Health. Let's take a look at Clover Health. So today Clover Health has been um, on fire. If you can see what happened today, Clover Health came, just popped out of the gate and squeezed to a high of about $24 uh, dollars and some change. Um, as when I was doing this video, it had pulled back down to around 18. So um, again, you can probably see it that retracement from 20 from 18 back to 24 and maybe even higher, depending on uh, what those Reddit and uh, you not know, people on all these uh, chat groups decide to do. If they decide to go all in, they anticipate you think and go test like 30. So again, it's a meme stock. So if you if you have any profit in any of these stocks, secure the profit before chasing more. Then next one is Bling Charging. So let's bring up Bling Charging here. Bling Charging today hasn't done that much, but if we go back five days, um, it's up 16%. Uh, if we go back a month, it's up 30, almost 35%, which is insane. So again, if you, if you were in Bling Charging, let's say if you bought uh, back here at 26, it's now almost at 41 when I was doing this video. So again, it falls in that category of meme stock. Then um, next on the list is, uh, so you have uh, GL and, and FUV. Um, those, I, those are like companies you don't really know the names. So what I've noticed is most of the stocks that are that find themselves on this list and that are main, main street stocks that people actually know the companies, those are the ones that usually would squeeze a lot. So, like, if you say, if you look here, I would rather take Bed Bath and Beyond as opposed to the Geo Group because a lot of people don't know the Geo Group. So, I'll take Bed Bath and Beyond uh, as my number four. So, let's bring that up here again. Same thing uh, today. It came out of the gate, squeezed to a high of about uh, almost forty dollars and some change, and then um, pulled back down. So, if we go last month, it's up forty six percent, which is insane. That's awesome. And then last but not the least, even though it's not uh, up here, it actually got out of this the top, I think top 20 or top 30, but still has momentum um, as far as um, meme stocks is AMC. Let me bring that up. So if you can see here, AMC today uh, tested at $60 and then pulled back down sitting somewhere around 55 right now. But if you go five days, it's up 48% or 49%. If you go a month, it's up 474%.
guys, this is insane. And I and I still think that AMC has momentum. AMC has momentum to go test at least a hundred dollars. Um, at some point, it has to consolidate, which is what it's doing right now. So again, that is my personal opinion. So just a quick recap here, guys. Uh, we're talking about top five stocks with short interest over twenty percent, and this is my top five. So first one here is Clover Health, which we've seen it have this monster move today. Um, second one is Workhorse. Again, we'll see another move. Um, and then third is Blink Charging. Again, still has over 35% uh, you know, return for the month. And then if we switch to Bed Bath & Beyond, 40, 46%. And finally, AMC for the month sitting at 473%. So those are my top five. You can let me know in the comment section uh, what you guys think about this list. And again, I'm going to put a link to this uh, website, highshortinteresttocks.com. You can definitely go there and, and not look, go through the list and pick some of the stocks that you see here that you think people know. And then you can go you can go into Reddit and just like search for those keywords. It would pop up and then you can now see what people are saying about that particular stock. You can add it to your watch list. So that's been my strategy. So again, let me know if you have any questions. If you're new to the channel, we talk about how to earn money, how to save money, how to invest and build wealth. So if that's something that interests you, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and the notification bell so you don't miss out on new content. Also, if you're looking to get started with investing, Weibo has their promotion right now where if you sign up and deposit $100, you get free stocks. Links in the description below. And as always, guys, do your due diligence. Don't be a greedy savage and stay motivated.